good morning i'm starting another vlog i'm i'm in the car right now because i'm doing school runs i've already dropped the two older kids and i have zuriel behind me zuriel say hi hi yeah so they wear masks every day every every second they are wearing masks in the car in in the school masks were in the car and she has this among us mask the kids that are watching this video will know the game among us so she's wearing the mask so um let me have that career so something happened the other day the first day she went to school uh, she she came back she made a friend apparently and her friend so graciously gave her a gift her friend gave her this markers and then while i was impressed and happy that her friend gave her something on second thoughts, I was like, but is this okay? Is this okay for her friend to do this? Do her parents know and everything? But the next day, she came back and then she took the marker and kept it back in her backpack. She said that her friend, the one that gave her the marker, said her mom said she should bring the marker back. <laughs> and I was like, eh, hey, because it's, it was a nice gesture, but um, I'm sure her parents will not have approved of that and then so she's returning it today she's returning the marker today but i've taken a picture of the marker so that i can buy for her as well but i've been telling her i've been trying to explain to her that it's not okay for her friend to give out something like that because her mom her parents bought it so she should have asked permission from her parents now can you hear me she should have asked permission from her parents before giving out the marker but it's a good thing it means that the girl has a good heart and it means that when she grows up she's going to be a giving person and it's going to be okay because then she'll be giving out things that she buys with her own money and she will not need anybody's permission to do that you understand and even self um, nano herself did something very impressive to me this morning so her sister in the other school sometimes it gets really cold there are some classes she enters and it gets really cold because of the ac so she usually takes her jacket along with her to school so this morning she was in a rush in fact she was not in a rush the girl just likes to she likes to to waste time and then she forgot her jacket at home so when we got to the school gate she now told me that hey that i forgot my jacket i forgot my jacket and i said because that's not my business go in from my car she now on force it so so as she was going Zeriel at the back now said can she take my jacket because she has her own jacket in her bag maybe she doesn't need it i don't know she said she shall offer to give her sister her jacket because she didn't want her sister to be cold and i said oh it's okay so she gave her sister the jacket and that one now took it and went into, into the class and i was trying to explain to her as well that what she did was also very nice it was a nice gesture for her to offer her jacket for her sister that was very kind and very impressive and i'm happy you did that okay keep up attitude like that it's very good mm? all right let's go let's go we're waiting for there's a queue there's a queue at the school gate so we're waiting for some spaces to clear up so that we can find space to park because school runs here is tough there's usually no parking space let's go find somewhere to park and then i'll see you guys later bye <laughs> there's always traffic right here and <sighs> I don't like the fact that there's always traffic here. A lot of people, the rush during school runs are eh, is just so stressful. So I have to go find somewhere to park right now so that I need to go find somewhere to park so that I can go inside school with her because I need to ask um, the admin a question. Yeah, so let's go find parking space. Even if I don't find on this street, I'll find on the other street. You know what? Nano, you can drop here, okay? Let me pack so that you can drop. Hi, so I have to quickly rush to school right now. <laughs> I got home. I just finished cleaning the kitchen, cleaning the restroom. As I was about to start sweeping the whole house, the school called me and told me that Michelle's belly is hurting her, that she's there with them and that she's be her belly is hurting, that do I want to come pick her up? In fact, I should come and pick her up. I told my husband that see you, the school called me that Monachi is having belly ache. He said, okay, I should just quickly go and pick her up. So I'm going back now. I'm packed in front of the school right now, waiting because there are some parents in there. 
so you can't overcrowd the office so i have to wait for some parents to come out for me to go in and go and check and bring her home to know what is wrong with her thank god i have my id card because before you come pick up kids like this you have to show your id for them to be sure that you are not here to kidnap somebody speaking all right so let me go in there now i'm just waiting now let me see there i don't know i don't even know if i'm supposed to go to the nurse or if i should just wait here because i just don't know let me just wait when the lady comes out i'll talk to her yeah What happened? Let's go. <laughs> what happened to you? Huh? Are you serious? Your tummy is hurting you. You feel like you need to throw up. But you ate this morning. You ate rice. Is it hunger? The car is in front. Huh. Now, wow. But this morning, you didn't have any sign at all that anything was wrong. You didn't feel different. You didn't feel anything. Huh. So what's in your hand? The paper. What's that? Okay. Not from health that you're going home. Okay. Take. Let me open the car. So um, I'm here to buy a birthday cake for Dindu. He turned 12 last week and today we're celebrating it. So I'm going to get one of those vanilla cheesecake cakes and then they're going to write happy 12th birthday Dindu on it for me. Yeah. So after this, I still have other things to buy. I'll see you guys later. Hey. Guys, I don't really like to drink wine, but I just like to look at it. Like the display, it's perfect. Look at this one. This one is so pretty. It's so pretty, guys. So yeah, let me ask you guys, which one do you like to drink? Red wine or white wine? The only time I ever crave wine is when I'm pregnant. <laughs> yeah. When I'm pregnant, I crave red wine a lot. But I think I prefer red wine. No, I prefer white wine to red wine, ordinarily. It's only pregnancy that makes me crave red wine. There's this particular one I'm looking for. I can't find it, but I did not come here to buy wine now. If I find that one, I will take it. If I don't find it, I will go. It's not here. I know where to go. Yeah. Anyway, let me go get other things. We'll see you later. Let me tell you because something eh? It seems like I shop like 100 times in a month. Jesus. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Did my egg. Hey, Jesus. My eggs fell and they did not break. They didn't even crack. Jesus. Thank you so much. Eh? How? Huh. So I was saying that it seems like that at this rate I, it's like I shop 100 times in a month honestly because was it not just like last week that I came here to stock up some things yeah? and I thought that when the children start going to school I thought that when the children start going to school that the expenses will reduce yeah they are still eating like horses huh? everything used to finish very fast I'm always coming here to buy things you buy you think and then when you finish buying you'll be like hey thank god i finished buying for the month or for the next two months no more yeah they will finish it all look at that bread that i bought the inyama look at where my husband kept this thing let me let me hide it so that people not look at it next thing now trolls will come for me and say look at how you're hanging rag inside your car come on Barcelona. there's a beetle chasing me look at it I'm done. Let me head home because I still need to go to Dollar Tree to buy balloons for my boy's birthday. <laughs> I lost some of my footage, yo, because that bit to chase me. Hey, that bit to chase me. I shall beat it. I use my phone and hit it. 
and then it flew up to the roof but i lost some of my footage i lost <laughs> but no voila let me go to dollar tree anyway let me go to dollar tree and um that beetle is like they, they sent it from achi yeah what's it touchy shebi is from achi that they sent that beetle huh i busy from walker <laughs> i don't know anyway let me go to dollar tree let me go buy balloons for my son for his birthday he said he wants balloons yeah all right see you bye I can see them coming so <laughs> Michelle went to bring us he said look at them look at this one legs for days legs for days <laughs> hello hi. hi say hi to everyone hi. you were not wearing mask when you left this car mm. who gave you mask Mr. Garden, is it a brand new mask? Yeah. It better be. And it's pink. I like it. Keep it you keep it in your bag. Yes. What is his name? Mr. Golden. 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 Is it Golden or Gooden? If Golden. I say Gooden, people will laugh at me. Now you are saying Golden. <laughs> let's go. Let's go you to the Hindu school and wait for him. Huh? You were sick? Because Jim is not sick. Exactly. Smart girl. She, she, they caught me. Her school, they called me and said that she's having tummy ache, that we should come and pick this your sister up. I don't understand how she's having tummy ache. She has not confessed. She's going to tell us whether she, she made it up or not. We are going to have a talk. Yeah, uh huh? We are going to have a talk. Because since, so I've been watching this girl at home since. I've not seen signs of the tummy ache. Anyway, let's go. We are not packed well. The place that we packed. This place that we packed is not good. How was school today? Good. What happened? Tell us what happened. My friend was with the um, thing hitting people because that's what we are supposed to do. And people are running and then... It's like tag but since there's COVID, they, they give us like this, you know, there's this foam thing that they give us so that we will not touch the person which is instead of using our hand. Okay, you don't touch people. You use the foam thing to touch. So it's a game of tag. Tag is the one where you run and you touch someone and then the person becomes it. And then instead of touching people, you use the foam thing to touch people. So according to you, Zuriel, the foam things are color coded. So each color has some, okay, like if the purple one touches you, you do squats, mm -hmm. right? If the blue one touches you, you do jumping jacks. So does it mean everybody runs around with foam stuff? No, just two people two people runs yeah, so one person runs around with the purple one and the other person runs around with the with the blue one mm -hmm. so which one touched you the purple one the purple one touched you so you did squats mm -hmm. oh how many squats did you do <laughs> just five. Oh, just five okay that's good you're lucky my own teacher he said that every day we'll be doing temple shops temple one shops day, yeah, <gasps> one day the push Everybody will do 100 push ups. That's so mean. And then he now said, because we're going to do a fitness test. And then if we pass it, that's in high school, while people are doing PE, like they, they don't need to do PE because they pass the fitness, the fitness test. test. That means, so that's like an exam on its own, mm -hmm. like fitness. So that means you have to be fit so, so that you can pass it. So that means, eh, but you do PE every day, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that will help you be fit, to be become fit. Yeah. Okay, so we're waiting in the car. But we, can I talk, please? Please, can I say something to my fam? All right. So we're waiting in the car. It's um, it's about four minutes to closing time in the other school. So, well, we said instead of going back home, let's just perch here because other parents are already packed waiting. In the next four minutes, the sister will go and call him. Me, I'm not coming out of this car. I'm just going to sit down here and wait. All right. Hi. Hi. Sorry to bother you, man. Uh, okay. So I'm offering a math class. Oh, okay. So I'm, I'm an engineer full time. Okay. And after work, I teach mathematics. Oh. Okay. I recently moved to Gardena. I, I used to live in Orange County, and I did this like all across the schools. Um, 
I teach them um, twice a week. Yeah. And I teach them um, so well. I'm not lying. I teach so well that they okay. don't need a tutor in the future, and they're not afraid of math. Oh. So. So I'm, where do we? Where where do the classes hold? It's a, it's about two to three blocks from here. here okay. I'm, let me give you the. You uh, have a flyer. Yeah. Okay. So in the back is the information for this class, and it's twice a week. Twice a week. Twice for a how week? long? How many? An classes? hour and a half. Yeah, an hour and a half. Okay, no, I'm asking for how long do they have to to um, attend the classes? Oh, so I have five classes. Okay. So courses, courses. So the first okay. one is basic math, elementary math, pre-algebra. Okay. Algebra, algebra okay. two, and trigonometry. So okay. So the first class, elementary math, it's twelve weeks. Yeah. That's it. Okay. So what I what I teach in one year, the schools teach in four years. So from sixth grade up, right? Pretty much. I have kids that are in third grade. Oh, okay. So, as long as they know their times tables, they qualify. Yeah, because I see from for ages 10 to 15. Yeah. That's what so I'm asking. So, right now, I, have, I only have 20 spots available. Okay, so this is the number to call. Yes. Okay. So, or that's my email. number and yeah. that's my email. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, anyways, thank you for your time, man. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. All right, what's the time? 2.59. Yeah, I think you should start heading out, right? Oh, no, no, wait. Let me be sure that the gates are open before you go, okay? You don't want? I don't do not again, you don't want to attend. Mm. Is it up to you? Is it up to you? Yeah. Don't worry, let your, let your grades come in first. We'll see. We'll see about that. But first of all, we need to go call your brother. It's 3 o'clock. But I don't know, the gate is not yet open. Let's wait for the gates to open. All right, guys, I don't want this vlog to be so long. So let me just end this one right now we might see in another scenario in the words of how's the bad guy scenario okay bye for now bye. bye guys let me show you people something i don't know do you have any remedy for this thing this is what happens first of all let me tell you people this is how my fingernails are I don't used to eat my fingernails because some people, whenever they look at my fingernails, they say I used to chop my nails. I don't chop it. This is how they bomb me. Uh -huh. So I want to show you people. You see all these things. I don't know if it's focused. You see all these things that looks as if my flesh or rather my skin is peeling off. I'm tired of it. It happens to me a lot. I don't know if it's because I I wash a lot. I wash. I'm always washing. See, I cannot count how many how many dishes. And kitchen, kitchen, masuko kitchen, and kitchen utensils I wash every day. So I don't know if it's because my hands are always in water. See, and sometimes it's painful. Sometimes it doesn't hurt. Like right now, they don't hurt, but some of them are pretty uncomfortable. Like here, it, look at this one. Oh my goodness, this one eh, it feels very uncomfortable. It doesn't hurt. I'm sure some of you might know the feeling I'm talking about. But my question now is, what do I do? How do I get rid of this thing? I said, how do I make it stop? I know how to get rid of it right now. I can just take um, baby nail clippers and clip them all off. Like I always do. Even the other hand. It's just that this other one is not much right now. Yeah, but you can see. It's not much right now, but uh, it's especially this finger right now. But uh, I'm looking for a lasting solution to this issue. What can I do? What can I do to make it stop peeling? Who else has this issue? Let me know in the comment section. Okay? All right. Look at him. He doesn't know I'm filming him. I think he knows. He's too smart. This is what used to catch somebody. <laughs> Hello? How you doing? How you doing all right? Huh? Is it not you that I'm talking to? How was school? Take off your mask. Just for a second, let's see your complete face from beginning to end. Are you shy? What happened in school today? Nothing. Did something happen? No. Are you sure? Yes. Look at the camera. Are you sure? <laughs> is he shy that he's shying you? Okay, well, let's go home. Daddy's even calling me. Yeah, hurry up. <laughs> Did you see your sister? She's back. Where did she go? Where did she go since? Where has she been? Hmm. Where? To school. To school. And she's back now. Mm -hmm. Did you ask her how school was today? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. She said school was nice. Where is your cross? Has it fallen off? No, it's behind me. Yeah. So, Zite, 
She's back from school and she had fun. When are you going to start going to school? Ah, oh, you both. When will you start going to school, Mama? Today. Today? Mm -hmm. Really? Yes. Uh oh. Don't worry. In May, in the month of May, 2022, you start, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Mommy, I want pink to this color. You want what? I want pink color. Pink color. Mm -hmm. What do you want to use it to do? Pink color of what, by the way? The pink color is the backpack. Because what did she say? Pink color backpack, I think. A backpack? Mm -hmm. Okay, you want a pink backpack for school. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. so what color of water bottle do you want? Pink. Pink. Okay, what color of shoes do you want? Pink. You mean you want everything about you to be pink? Yes. Why? Because I still my favorite color is pink. Look okay. at it over there. Okay, because your favorite color is pink. Oh, okay, I see. So guys, <laughs> I want to show you people something. So I'm in front of my kids' school waiting for them to close again another day. See, this vlog is all about... It's beginning to... At this point, there, it's just like this vlog is all about school. My school week. Like, my, my week as a school mom. Anyway, so look at this guy in front of me. Whoever owns this car is a very expressive person and a very, I don't know <laughs> what words to use. So, look at, take a look at the stickers on this person's car. First of all, the one that interested me the most, the one I saw first was this one. This one over here. Hello. Hello, Joe Biden. That's kind of like a wordplay. It makes sense. Look at it now. Hello, Joe Biden. You know, we all know that that's Biden. It's not the... It's not the spelling of Biden, you know. So that is by Don. The Don is Donald Trump. So apparently this person is a supporter of Joe Biden. And then he wanted Trump out. So he bought the sticker, Hello Joe Biden. So it's saying two things at the same time. Welcoming Joe Biden into office and then saying bye-bye to Donald Trump, you get? <laughs> I found it very funny. And then I looked down. Look down there. You see this other one? You can't fix stupid, but you can vote it out. My goodness. I said this person, eh? <laughs> and I think this person is like an activist of some sort because you can see the BLM sticker there as well. And then you can see the equality, this equality sticker over there. Okay, that's enough. I'm just whiling away time in this car. I said, let me show you people what I saw because I found it very funny. Okay, so <laughs> let me end this vlog right now because it's already long enough it's already too long and like i said in fact i'm going to title this vlog a day in the life of a school mom because it was all about school by the way i've made my hair i did it by myself i i always do i know people be wondering why i like to do this style i can braid my hair but i just prefer to do this crochet style because it's easy and quick you will not blame me if you have five children in the abroad you are gonna be able to relate because i want something fast and easy and quick so this is it it's nice it's really nice i think i even did better i get better every time anyway because i talk too much i've said it before i talk too much in my videos and i don't really talk this much in real life all right it's okay it's okay we're gonna see ourselves in the next video Bye bye